Everybody, it is Tea Talk with your girl back with just a little more commentary. But listen, make sure while you're here, you like this video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the Tea Talk family. Might as well. We ain't going nowhere. Now, listen, all things are alleged and in my very own opinion. Okay. They for entertainment purposes only. So come on, let's talk about it. Y'all. I ain't know Destiny try to get old Ben to be her chemist. Y'all, Destiny been single black female in it. This ain't new, y'all. Listen, Destiny been copying off mail for the longest, y'all. Now, who would have thought that she went behind Mel's back and tried to steal her chemist? She didn't go to Mel first and ask, <clears throat> do you mind if I use Obia? What do you think about me using Obia? Would there be a conflict of interest if I use Obia? Melody, what's your thoughts on me using Obia? You didn't do none of that. Oh, no, no, no. You went behind Mel's back. You went in her chemist thinking that her chemist was like you unloyal. So you went in her chemist thinking that her chemist, like I said, was like you and would take money. You know, kind of like you're doing right now, being pimp for pennies, coming on here, making a fool of your goddamn self. Yeah. You thought Obia was like that, but you found out real quick. You found out real quick, Destiny, that Obia wasn't like you, okay? You found out the hard way. Obia ain't nothing like you, Destiny. It's a lot of people not like you. Unfortunately, you just hang around the people like you with low vibrations. Tisha, Kimmy, Trisha, oh, Lockjaw. That's the type of people you like hanging around with because they just like you. They got low vibrational thinking, and they agree with the bullshit you, that you be doing. But baby, Obia didn't agree with you. And she said no. But I just want to drop that little nugget since Mel let us know that. Yeah, old Destiny was over there single black female in it trying to take her chemist. Ain't that some shit, y'all? Mm-mm-mm. Drop down in them comments and let me know what you think about this. Don't forget to like the video, all right? Bye. I don't think Sean made it. Sean has filmed on this show with Dawn and myself before, several years ago. Go back to some older episodes of Love and Marriage Huntsville. Okay, we're doing the body scrubbing body butter, okay? So Sean has been on the show before. We filmed in my conference room in my office, okay? Um, and then we had a meeting, I think it was maybe a year ago, year and a half, where my whole team came in and Dawn, um, Yvonne, um, Heather, and it's so crazy because the project we talked about with Heather, we're really doing it with the kids in Jersey. We talked about it then on the show, it happened. And um, Lisa and what she's got going on, I just haven't spilled it to y'all yet, but I'm not telling. So y'all just got to wait. But she did what she said she was going to do. So it's been some amazing stuff. But anyway, we went to dinner. Y'all know I love to take people out to eat. So after we finished filming, after we finished filming, I took all of them to Connors. So we went to Connors and ate. There you go. We went to Connors and ate. And while we were sitting there eating... You know, we started, I think Dawn just started talking about just how, you know, how amazing God is and how she's seen him move in my situation and just everything, you know. And that is when, um, that is when uh, Obia told me, you know, that Destiny had reached out. So, and she was like, but I don't do mess. She was like, and I was like, nah, I'm, I don't even feel comfortable. I'm not doing it. And I was like, what? She did what I said, girl. So that was, I'm just now telling y'all, but however long ago that was, whenever that scene was, it was definitely over a year. It was definitely over a year. So, yeah, I told y'all I'm talking. Did I tell y'all that? <laughs> did I tell y'all I'm talking?